Hey guys, meteorologist Chris Tomer here with this afternoon mountain weather update. I'm going to cover two things. Um, we'll cover the storm in the Pacific Northwest and where it's headed. And two, we're going to go right to this, this surge of warm air that's hitting the Sierra, the Wasatch, Colorado, the Teton. So this is Utah. These are air temperatures, current air temperatures. This is Little Cottonwood Canyon. Here's Big Cottonwood. So 210, Highway 210, leading up to Alton, Snowbird closed through Friday. The worry is, with so much new snow, and this big warm-up, we're going to have wet slab avalanches that rip all the way down to 210. Certainly possible. Here, for example, it is currently 53 degrees at 9,600 feet, Alta Collins and Little Cottonwood. Um, over in Big Cottonwood Canyon, 55 degrees, Reynolds Peak at 9,400 feet. So my forecasts are verifying 59 degrees, my goodness, at 9,400 feet. Um, so I did write about it this morning. Warm surge, ChrisTomer.com. Warm surge, then snow. So warm out ahead of this Pacific storm, and then the storm will drag a cold front through on or after 412, 413. Forecast freezing levels. Today I had 13.3 in the Wasatch. No question we'll get there. 13.1 tomorrow, still very high, 24.7 above freezing. And then it drops way down, 6,700 by 413. So that's the margin of safety they're looking for to open up 210 is we got to get these temperatures back to reasonable levels. Um, Central Colorado, Central Mountain Zones, 13.8 today, 14.4 tomorrow. That's the max. That's above most of the 14ers in Colorado, that 32 degree line. 13.7, 4.12. It's another big one. Tetons, 12.5 today, 12.3 tomorrow. Drops way down to 5,300 feet on 4.13. My forecast temps today we're all at 50 plus for all of the for all of the Wasatch. We're there. Um, potentially 60s for Park City, or warmer. Forecast pattern. That's the jet from this morning. Let me show you what it is this afternoon. Very similar. A little stronger jet, more velocity. The low is sitting somewhere off the west coast. Could be more Pacific Northwest based on this, but that's 419 down the road. All right, let's go back. Uh, I want to show you the forecast, radar, and satellite. Here's Tuesday morning, all quiet, Intermountain West, sunny, waiting on the storm. Here it comes, breaks loose out of the Pacific Northwest, on or about 412, 413. Snow, colder air, Utah, Wyoming, big sky, Colorado. You can see it happening. And then we're back to quiet conditions, waiting on that next area of low pressure that I showed you, which will come drifting in from the Pacific. Back to the blog. These are my numbers from this morning. Let me show you what I'm thinking this afternoon. 410, the rest of today through 412, it's all in the Pacific Northwest and it's not that heavy. Um, 413, storm breaks loose. 414, 415, we get snow. Um, Tetons, Wasatch, Big Sky, and Colorado. Get the, the cold air and the snow out of that. Not forecasting a ton for the Wasatch, probably three to six. But the trend has been to go up a little bit since the last update. Um, the Colorado numbers have gone down. Uh, they've trended down. But that's the way it looks through 419. Lots to talk about as we shift seasons. So um, I'll keep, uh, keep on top of it. Always appreciate you guys tuning in here, and take care.